Now, also making us proud is what's happening in the world of theatre. The highly anticipated theatre production, Blame It On Bollywood, hit South African shores earlier this month with seven performances at the Teatro at Monte Cassino in Johannesburg. Now, Expresso was given a glimpse of this humorous display of all the glitz and drama that surrounds an Indian wedding. Punjabi filmy tadka. Don't blame changing times for the situation, Aj. For all that's happened to Indian weddings, just blame it on Bollywood. Direct from India, Blame It on Bollywood deals with the age-old dilemma of a mixed marriage and the extravagance of modern celebrations. So the concept of big fat Indian wedding has been influenced by Bollywood films. So um, now every wedding has got a Bollywood night, uh, the sets look so larger than life, it looks like a whole production being put together. That's the influence and that's what the whole production speaks about. And when two families from two different cultures come together, it's one shebang, one mashup, and it's a musical. The show was written and directed by well-known theatre and film personality Bharat Bawaka and features high-energy performances. This was the first time we are doing this experiment by, we, by which we are getting Indian actors and South African dancers to merge together and do a fusion show. It's about Bollywood that you're aware of. It's got your local young girls and boys dancing in Indian costume. It's got all the elements that should appeal to a South African audience. The world loves Bollywood music, so they're hoping it'll work here. As with any Bollywood production, there's plenty of humor and even more music and dancing. The star-studded cast includes Indian theater, TV, and film actors. I play a girl called Rumjum, and uh, she's 22 year old, uh, madly in love, and she's back from the US, and uh, she's engaged, and that is the news that she has to break to the family now. He's an independent communications consultant. Means? Means he's unemployed. <laughs> oh, it's complete madness, because uh, like every Indian girl, in fact, like any girl, she wants a big wedding. Why Indian weddings are no longer short, sweet, and traditional? Oh no, Goswami wants to know. What uh, should have been over in three or four hours of rituals has actually been extended to almost a seven to eight day affair today. And he suddenly realizes that uh, nothing is in his hands anymore, and everything is going out of hand, and everyone wants to do the way they want to do, and after all, it's his daughter. How's your mother? Uh, she pokes in your life. Uh, she still thinks that you're five-year-old and she wants to do everything for you. And when she thinks that you're going to get married, she feels happy. She feels sad because the daughter is going away. But she wants the best, best marriage for her anybody has ever seen. No, Rumjum, no, no. Ah, what's wrong with Papa? I think with extreme stress, he has gone into a coma. What I enjoy the most about this production is the madness. It's just a fantastic team and I'm really lucky that I have such wonderful people I'm working with. So you should see Blame It on Bollywood. It makes a wholesome entertainment. So just come laugh, enjoy with us.